Let's talk about ways you can add images into your S'more lesson. So right here I have a, a text box that I can come in here and edit as needed. Um, but let's say I want to add a, a picture here that's going to illustrate it, just kind of draw attention to it possibly. When I hover over that text box, these little arrows appear. And when I click them, it gives me a space for a picture to be added to the right or to the left or not at all. Okay, so let's say I want to put in a picture to the right. I just go to that and then click and find a picture from my computer. Now you will have to have already saved that image to your computer. If you're not sure how to find and save images or to do screenshots and save those to your computer, you might reach out to one of your colleagues or to myself. I'd be happy to show you how to do that. So I'm going to find, I'm going to put in this image from my desktop. So click it and click open and it's going to put that image right next to um, my text, which is really nice. You can't do anything to save to change the um, the size of that image or cropping or anything like that. You're pretty limited on what you can do with it, but it's also super easy. Some other options, if I click over, um, hover over here and click my little button um, to bring up my options, you can see that I can add a picture or a gallery. If I click on picture, it's going to give me a chance to open a, put in a big picture or to put in a gallery again. Let's choose big picture first, click it, select my image, let's choose this one this time, and click open. And it's just going to put that image right into my lesson. Okay. Let's look at that gallery option. If I click gallery, it's going to give me a chance to add three different pictures. Um, you can add those pictures with captions, just like here. You can add titles and descriptions under each of them, or you can just add pictures in. Either of those options is fine. So I'm going to click this, you know, cl click my um, image that I want, it'll bring that in. I can give it a title and a description. And I can say I'm done. Um, let me just add one more real quick so that you can see what this is going to look like. And then I'm going to come up here and update my page. I want to show you what the finished version does for each of these. Okay, so here um, next to my instruction, you see when I hover over this, I get a little um, magnifying glass. That means I can click on it and see that image bigger. I should be able to do that. Can't do that with the big picture, but I can do that with this gallery as well. So I can click on those images and see them bigger, see those titles and descriptions if I've included those as well. So those are all different ways to add images to your lesson in S'more.